my name is Nick with Sunshine State RVs. We are the number one Class B dealership in the state of Florida. We're number three in the whole United States of America. And guys, it is freezing today. I don't know why I'm wearing shorts, but we are about to do a video on the brand new 2024 Road Trek Play. This is a very unique, very neat RV that Road Trek has made. It is on the brand new ProMaster chassis. It is 20 feet long. It has twin beds in the back with seat belts. It has the underhood generator. Lots of very, very cool things that Road Trek has put in here. But there's one very unique, very, very neat thing that Road Trek has put in this coach that I cannot wait to show you because when I saw it, I thought, my goodness, this is this is the coolest thing I've seen in one of these vans in a long time. You have to watch this video to see what that is. But at Sunshine State RVs, all we do are Class B RVs. We sell Class B RVs all over the country. We deliver free anywhere in the United States. We give free valet pickup and drop off for service around our area, guarantee service appointments in five days. All we do are Class B vans. So. I'm going to do this video showing you guys everything about this Class B van and we have lots of other videos. So check this out and see the one thing that I think that makes this Road Trek play different and unique than any other Class B on the market. Okay, so this is the Road Trek play. This is their um, entry level for the Road Trek. They make their Zion, which is their high-end uh, luxurious model. And this is the play, which is more of the entry model. It is a lot more affordable, which is really nice, but it doesn't sacrifice the quality that a road trek gives you. It still has the great two year warranty that road trek gives you. It's on the exact same pro master chassis with the same features that the same safety features, all the push button start, the big nav screen, all the features you're used to on the brand new pro master. But the things that are going to change are stuff like a power step. This gives you a nice stationary step here, a nice big step, where the Zion will give you a, a power step. So it is it is things like that that are different between the Zion and the Play, but there is definitely a place in the Class B market for this Road Trek Play. And I really think after watching this video, you're gonna see where that place is. So this is a ProMaster 20 feet. It does have the nice running board here. It has the nice new ProMaster wheels that are coming on, on the new models. Um, and then it has a whole new front end. So this is the new redesigned front end. So you can tell from the headlights and the front end that this is the 2023 model. Um, it's not the, uh, the 2022 model that they had. This is the upgrade. This is a 2024 Road Trek Play. So it is the upgraded model. As you're looking, you see that Road Trek has their three signature fake windows there. Um, on their original Road Treks, they were actual windows and everybody knew a road truck was coming down the road because you saw the windows but on the new ones they are just stickers but it's still very cool kind of nostalgic you know road trek was the original class b manufacturer from 1974 this is their 50th year making class b rvs that's a pretty big deal um and i think it's cool because you know they, there's stickers in here kind of celebrating the 50 years of road trek and i think being the pioneer in the class b market they would always innovate and then everybody else would kind of come and you know take versions of what they do and change it and make it better it's kind of like the iphone you know the iphone came out and then everyone else took the iphone fair okay how can we make it better you know what can we change but i think that road trek has they were the first to introduce lithium batteries they were the first to really introduce the class b van as like a full-blown rv so road trek is known for being innovative they're known for being at the top of their game so very cool a little bit of history there about Road Trek, but the three windows are trademarked by Road Trek. New ProMaster chassis, as we are walking around here, you will see things like the Zion has the power steps, the play does not. Are they necessary? Maybe, maybe not. We can always add steps if you want, but um, something that is very cool is that they give you a macerator and a gravity. So they have both. So it does have the macerator, you press a button and the waste gets pumped out. And then it also has the gravity tank in here as well. So what's very cool is that it has the macerator and it has the gravity. So in here, let's see, is this the right key? Maybe at 49, there we go. So this is locked up in here. This is the macerator hose right here. So we can just take that off. Let me just pop this whole thing out. They, they really do a great job with their hose. This is the macerator hose. This is a very thick, you know, our waste is very acidic. And so this is a very thick and durable hose. 
and this comes all i mean look at this this is insane right you can put it all the way out here and you can dump it um very nice hopefully when you're dumping it in, i always say this, you don't have a robin williams experience like in the movie rv because that would not be fun but if you did there is an outdoor shower where you can clean yourself off so this is the wasting this is i mean this is heavy heavy duty serious hose nice and long and there's also gravity so if this doesn't work for some reason you can use the gravity to waste to uh, dump your waste but this is very nice feature to have is the macerator and gravity i don't know another van that gives you both uh options to dump your tank so very cool this is your hot water heater and your furnace this is the uh gerard it, it is a tankless hot water heater it's very easily to service very easy to check out and maintain because it is right there it's not underneath the coach or hidden somewhere it's right there so as we're walking through like i said this is the outdoor shower Let's grab these keys here and show you everything people say i don't show them everything i'm gonna show you everything outdoor shower you pull it out you can put it right here it's hot it's cold water you can actually take a shower out here you can also bathe your dog you can clean dishes you can clean up whatever mess you made from your black water tank whatever you need to do can be done with that outdoor shower there your black water tank and all that there i really like how on the side here has like that automotive window look it's all windows all the way down the whole side of the road trek so very very cool um this does have the tow hitch and a 30 amp service for power is back here there's also a cable hookup back here as well so if you want to you have cable tv you can have cable tv here you can have your power 30 amp power hookup there so cable tv and power hookup there is a tow hitch this chassis can tow about 3,500 pounds. This is made in Canada, and I don't know how many um, kilograms 3,500 pounds is, but this can do 3,500 pounds with the tow hitch there. I will show you a little bit of the back here. Um, we will jump in. I'm hoping you don't see what I'm gonna show you, my, my, very, my, uh, big, my big surprise for the van, but very nice how back here your power cord is stored back here there are these big open cabinets there there's another one here and this is where your spare tire stuff is your fix a flat and your tire tools are here and obviously you can put those anywhere you want for right now this is where they're stored nice big wide open area here so let's say you're you go skiing and you have your skis in a case you can just throw them down the middle let's say you kayak or you mountain bike or you like to go e-biking or whatever it is there's a nice big space here that you can store whatever it is you're doing right here down the middle of your van right they also very cool there's a company that we just started working with called rover vans and what they do is they make boxes bike racks spare tire carriers for the back of these pro masters so very nice big you can put a box here you put a bike rack there you can also put one here um go small live large scott watson has a really cool rover van uh setup on the back of his pro master he he drives he full times in his travato and he has this really cool it's a box that he stores a lot of stuff it's a spare tire carrier and then on top of it he stores his mountain bike so very neat i'll i'll send i'll, I'll put a picture of that in in this video so you can see huge fans rover vans are great guys and they make this really nice big thing for the back of a pro master a lot of people are focusing on mercedes and ford uh, chassis where you know their uh, rover vans is making some cool stuff for pro master so as we're coming along here there is a power awning so as the play is uh does have um i don't want to say lower end but different things in the zion they do give you a power awning you can secure it here if you need for a little extra stability you don't have to you can just pull it out and it's and it's just out there but there again i really like the look out here there's the two led lights up there there's also the propane tank so what's cool about having the propane tank right here right because you say this is where you camp this is where you do all your stuff what's cool about it is right here this thing this is where you can hook up your propane grill so 
if you're camping, you would have your awning out, have some lights on. If it was my wife, she would hang some um, Christmas lights, some icicle lights from this. I'd have a little table here and I'd have a propane grill right here and I would use the propane from the tank to power my grill. So that way you can have a grill, a little grill that you carry around with you and you don't have to carry a separate uh, propane tank. It's all done right there. Some people like to use those, uh, like a, um, what's it called, a country, low country boil. You can, you can have one of those big things that you put all the food in and the, you can fry a turkey and use the propane and do it all right here. So lots of cool options with having, having the, uh, the propane extension on this side under the awning. So you can, you know, this is the camping side where you do everything. So let's jump inside and you're really going to see what I'm most excited to show you about this road trip play. So we are inside the van and now that we're in here, I can reveal the big thing. But if I reveal it or half you guys going to turn this video off after I show it to you. So maybe I'll wait till now I'll show you now. So we're in the van and this is what I think when I saw this, I thought it was pretty stinking awesome was these brand new cabinets that road trek is doing on these road trek plays so check this out this is a composite they call it a honeycomb composite material i don't know if that means there's bees living in here because it's honeycomb but this these are some of the coolest looking cabinets that i have seen in a class b van this is a very lightweight very lightweight composite material it is waterproof it feels kind of marine grade to me. So this is nice and smooth. There's this metal finish and then there's like this rigid wood looking insert in it. So marine grade, they're washed very easily to wash. They don't get smudges on them and they're waterproof. They're like this honeycomb composite. So I think they're very unique and all the way through as we're walking through the van, you'll be able to see. But this is one of the things that I think makes this road trek play so unique are these brand new cabinets that go and they're on the top cabinets there and they're on the doors they're on the big door there i like the mixed use of the materials so like the composite the metal and then the wood i think it gives it a very modern a very modern look so that's my opinion i love these cabinets i thought i, I thought these things were awesome and this is called the cashmere color pattern so cashmere honeycomb composite they're like a marine grade easily clean very lightweight very light everyone knows in an rv your goal is to be lightweight so that way you can carry more tow more you're not real heavy going down the road so this is a very lightweight cabinetry as well so as you walk in you'll see this is the same layout as the zion the same layout as the chase so lots of cool features in here you have this nice big countertop right here you have in this these this is a laminate countertop this is not granite like in the zion so that is another difference um you do have some power here so you have 12 volt you have uh the cell phone charger what's that called usb and then a 110 plug so very nice have all of that right there so if you want to set up a bluetooth speaker here if you want to you know cook something here you have your plugs and all of that there very easy to go up and down with it i say very easy and then i and then it, it embarrasses me. There you go. How's that? Very easy. Um, this is nice product placement, isn't it? Kind of matches. Um, so kitchen is here. You have big cabinets, square sink. I like the shower or the, the faucet head. You can move it around. You can also use it outside. If you need something, if you want to fill something out there or do something there. So very nice. If someone's, you know, kind of bothering you or getting in your way, you can kind of spray them a little bit from inside to outside. Um, there is a gas stove. So these are things that are a little different. So like on a Zion, you're gonna have induction. You're gonna have granite. On this, you have laminate and uh, propane stove. So I don't think one's better than the other. I don't think one's worse. I, it's just different, you know, and for the price savings. And you know, some people, they don't they don't want all that stuff. You know, they'd rather have something a little more simple, a little more entry level and, and save the money. So um, here are your controls up here. So you have your patio light, your water pump, there still is a 3000 watt inverter and your battery disconnect is here. And this is where you can see how full and how empty your tanks are by pressing this power awning here. You press the button and the awning goes out. Very, very simple to use. Everything is simple. 
and whatever is not simple to you, one of our technicians will teach you how to use it. So you fly down here, we cover your flight, we then pick you up from the airport, bring you to the dealership, teach you how to use everything on the RV, front to back, top to bottom, every single thing, we teach you how to use it. And then we put you up at a campground for the first two nights. So that way while you're camping, we can then help you through the beginning adventure of owning the new RV. When you leave Gainesville, you will know A, how to work your RV, and B, you'll know that everything works. Now, not to say things won't break in the future, but you'll know that everything works. When things do break in the future, we are there to help you as well. We guarantee service appointments. We give you a five-day window. Within five days, we guarantee to get you in for service. And if you ever need to call us, we give you tech support over the phone anytime you need. So we have our technicians available by phone to talk to people that have bought their vans, put their trust in us. We want to make sure that trust is warranted. So we will give you tech support over the phone anywhere you're at in the country and help you through any issues you have as well. So this is simple, but our guys will teach you how to use everything. Something else, these are very unique to Road Trek. So not only do you have the composite cabinets, you do have these big storage shelves. So give you an idea. This is a great size, that's a little big, so maybe we'll store it more like this. But good size storage, you can put a lot of stuff in here. You can store a lot. Um, and then this is also very cool, it's a big what they call a pots and pans drawer. So you kind of have an idea how big it is. This is a pots and pans drawer here. Um, and I like how it's not on the ground. Sometimes it's hard to pick up bigger things from the ground, I like how it's a little high. But what they did, a lot of people don't do. They elevated the fridge. They took the fridge off the ground, lifted it up. So that way, when you are reaching into the fridge, you are reaching in at waist level, which is very nice and easy to use. Those fridges that are on the ground, you have to almost lay down to get in the bottom of the back. So that's nice. This is the Verti Frigo is the, is the brand of it. Vitra Frigo, um, Italian fridge. Freezer, nice big freezer, so you can see Give you a cute little ice, look at that, little, little ice tray. But yeah, nice big freezer. Um, fit lots of ice cream in there. I'm a big fan of the ice cream. Um, you have, oh, look at this. I haven't seen that yet. Butcher block, how cool is that? This is brand new for 2024. Look at that. Butcher block, nice big cabinets there, nice big cabinets here. Great drawer with all your remotes and things. So very cool, everything that Road Trek includes there. And then you can even see more of this wood, this new honeycomb composite cashmere is what they're calling it. Very cool. So this is your wardrobe cabinet. So you can hang things there. They give you the leg for the table. There's a spot for a table in the front, spot for a table in the back. Nice big storage cabinet there. But I just love these cabinets. I, I, I truly think these cabinets are unique. I've, I've never seen cabinets like this in any van that we have sold. And we sell more vans than anybody in Florida. Number three in the nation. I've never seen cabinets like this. So big fan of these cabinets. So this is twin beds. As you can tell, there are seat belts on these twin beds. Um, I believe there's four of them, if I'm not mistaken. Might just be two. Let's see. Maybe there is just two on this side. So let's see how many there are. There are one, two... There are two seat belts on the driver's side. There are none on the passenger side. This can meet together and make one big bed. It can be twin beds. Um, it can also be, um, check this out. I thought this was pretty neat. So this kind of lifts up like the Road Trek Chase and this elevates so that way your head can be elevated. Look at that. So there's this like whole little system here where you can elevate the back. So if you like to sleep with your head elevated, I can show you how this works. So you just kind of lay down and your head is elevated. I'm six foot tall and I have plenty, plenty of space. This here, obviously, we would get rid of, but lots of space here. Same thing on this side. If we move all of this over, I can even, I'll get rid of it on this side to show you. Here, this will go here. Let's hide the seat belt into the little crevices where they want you to put it. Now, let's lift this up. There we go. So now, nice big bed. There again, 
lots of space, very comfortable that it's not a, a couch and a bed. It is truly a big, thick cushion. So very comfortable. And then if you wanted, there are slats to go in between and this could go in between just like this and it can make a king size bed and it fits perfectly in there. Um, I think everybody understands how that works, but I like how thick this is. I mean, that's probably six inches, eight inches thick, very thick, very comfortable as well. So I would say this is one of the more comfortable beds you're gonna find in a class B van. Um, there is a spot for a table here. So there is that leg that I showed you in the wardrobe closet. You can put right there and there is a table that is stored right here. So you just pick the table up and we would put the table, looks like. So this table will go just like this. So now you have a table and a leg. You know what, we're doing a video. Let's go all out today, how's that? So, grab a leg and show you what this is gonna look like. So here, there, and ta-da. So now you have a dining situation. So you can be sitting here, you can be eating, playing cards, you can also be working. So this one has the technology package. So the technology package comes with uh, 200 plus watts of solar. It comes with the antenna and it comes with a smart TV. So this is a smart TV right here. So the smart TV can also double as another monitor for your laptop or your computer. So if you're working from your van, you can use a smart TV, you can hook an internet router up here, which we do all the time, and you can have your laptop working from here. Um, this can also be a, obviously, a dinner table. You can be playing cards, um, just hanging out. So I think this is a great table. You know what I think is really neat? Check this out. So I, how do I get this off? Um, there we go. That was interesting. I like where they store it. So I like that it's stored in the door. So, so often, Class B vans, um, you have to find storage for things, and they store this table in the door. That, that door is doing nothing else, but just it's always going to be there. It's not in the way. So storing the table outside and then storing this thing, very easy. Right in here, they give you the little place. I just think Road Trek's been doing this since 1974. They know a few things. So really like the twin beds. Really like how, how this is padded back here, warm and comfortable. These windows do, they open completely, so you can slide it open there. There's also a screen, so if you have a screen, all four of these windows back here do that. And then this is the night version of that window, right here, so that's a nighttime shade. So you have nighttime, you have screens, the same thing back here, and the same thing over here, so very nice. These are cool. So these cabinets open by this little contraption right here so you hold that and it opens so they do stay shut and locked um they give you a bunch of owner's manuals so you have a cabinet there you have a cabinet here that has plugs in it which is very nice to give you some extra plugs if you have a cpap machine they have a plug back here they have a 110 plug back here if you do have a cpap machine your 110 plug can be right here and you can store your CPAP machine inside. And this side has it as well, in case two people have CPAP machines. There's there's the storage for that. So all the way back here, this is all nice big storage. Um, there's also storage here. And this is your solar charge controller. Like I said, there is solar on the roof. So the solar on the roof is charging the AGM battery, the underhood generator also charges the AGM battery, and there are 200 plus watts of solar that charge it. Um, talking about storage, you know, in the Zion, people have absolutely fallen in love with these, with these drawers. There are lots of drawers and lots of storage there. Nice big drawers. And then there are, well, there's a few more in the Zion. But, you know, like I said, this is the play, so there are gonna be some change-offs. So, as we're, we're gonna flip around, I'm gonna show you the ProMaster front really quick. Um, this is the Dodge ProMaster, so this does have all of the latest Dodge uh, things on it. So, 
nice big screen push button start it does have your cell phone charging station here like i said with the push button start the key just stays in your pocket and never has to go anywhere um, you walk in push the button and you start it it has an all digital dash here um, i really like how there's all these different options on this with the navigation the satellite radio apple carplay android carplay um, nice big can't let, oh i can't do it because the seat's swiveled but nice big backup camera um usc ports and usb ports right there so they're both they're both here so something pretty cool about road trek is they do give you 24 7 road uh roadside assistance um so that that is unlimited towing jump starts uh dealer locator service all of that delivery of fuel so everything you need there on their um brochure here they give you a qr code that qr code is the owner's manual and all the other information you need so if you're ever lost or confused there is a hard copy of the owner's manual in there but there's also a qr code that can take you to their website so all of this information is great we're gonna have pdfs up showing all the specs and showing all of the options on this coach here but i really i mean i'm just really impressed with everything that this pro master and this road trek play has to offer they do give you a couch in the back if you don't like the twin beds so you can do twin beds or a couch but you know we are road treks number one dealer in the country in north america so we sell more road treks than anybody else we've been with road trek since i don't know 2014 i think so almost going on to 10 years now we've been selling brand new road treks and i'm a huge fan of theirs um in a couple weeks i'm actually going up to their factory i don't think i can wear shorts in toronto when i go up there but in a couple weeks i'm gonna be going up to their factory taking a tour there me and hank and we are going to be checking everything out that road trek has and and what they're offering and everything from the westphalia to the pivot to all of the new latest and greatest that's coming out on road trek so check out this road trek play on our website and we have all full line every other road trek that is offered we have in stock in gainesville florida we will deliver it free to your house or we will fly you here so you can pick one out, camp in it, and take it home. So thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, please let me know. Let us know in the comments below. And once again, thank you guys for watching all of our videos.